Thank you to Skillshare for sponsoring this video. Skillshare is an online learning community with hundreds of different classes ranging all different types of topics. So we've got things like illustration, lifestyle, business type classes, a real rich variety of things. So you can go in looking for something specific or not specific at all and just enjoy yourself and discover something new. That's what I'm doing this month with the class that I'm taking which is illustrated environments, draw a stylized landscape scene in Procreate by Sarah Holiday, who is an illustrator from Scotland. Although I will never be able to draw like this, I just still think it's so interesting to watch and learn somebody's process. So if you would like to watch along, most Skillshare classes are under 60 minutes, so they're easy to fit into any type of schedule. And if you would like to join the first 1,000 people to use the link, will get a one month free trial of Skillshare. All classes are, of course, ad-free, so you can have uninterrupted learning. Thank you again to Skillshare for sponsoring this video. Okay, quick apologies. This little mic of mine that I really like most of the time decided not to save any of the files that I recorded this week for some reason. I'm very offended by it. So I am apologize greatly for this ass quality of audio. So sorry about that. Hello, how are you all doing? I am trying to be productive today and optimistic and happy trying to be. If you missed it, uh, my dog Rocky, who I rely a lot on emotionally, is um, had to stay behind because I was visiting my homeland, Belize, and I had taken Rocky and his rabies shot expired while we were there and they wouldn't let him on the plane and a dog can't travel within 30 days of getting said rabies shot. So I literally had a breakdown in the middle of this freaking airport. But good thing everybody had already was already on the plane and I was um, having my breakdown. The decision to do that was, but I had a lot of commitments here in New York, so I had to, like I had no choice. But we're from Belize, so if there's a will, there's a way. And so Rocky will be back in like beginning of July. Anyways, what was the point of that? Oh, I've not been doing very well, but I need to do get things done at this point, you know. I need to stop being so sad or it's okay to be sad but like I do for it to stop affecting my daily processes so much so before uh, I got my second dose of the vaccine which was like a month ago two months ago now I just started a new routine I'm very much a night owl I live most of my life at night and waking up is extremely hard for me but I had started a routine of like waking up at 8 or 9 a.m. and then going to sleep at like 12 a.m. and it was very nice very I felt it was productive enough for me, you know? It was it was good. But then when I got the second dose of vaccine, it really hit me hard and my cramps are really bad. And then since then I have not been able to create that routine again. And all my classes are at 9 a.m. And so I really need to be waking up on time. Last week I was half an hour late. 
go to my mom i think it was like 20 minutes okay it's fine um and my teacher had mar marked me as present anyways so thanks anyways and other things that i need to be working on are my patreon i'm going to be opening a patreon which i will assume that i will tell you more about later on in this video look out for it it will be open in july there'll be three tiers and the last tier will be mailed postcards um three and i've ordered them and i can't wait for them to come in and i just reopened the shop yesterday and i just got new packaging supplies in the mail um which i needed and i need to unbox that and stamp them all and then what else oh i need to do my homework for tomorrow's class so that's the plan hope you enjoy goodbye <laughs>
Wednesday. Hi, Wednesday, Dad. Today's Wednesday, and I am going to go be on a podcast today. Am I shooting myself? Yes, because I'm not very good at talking, you know? I will be talking to people, and my brain is just gonna go like... Again, my little mic screwed me over. Okay, very rude. But essentially what I was going on about was the podcast that I was going on is my friend Slews, who I met at Parsons my freshman year. And he's an artist and now a big YouTuber guy. And he's starting a podcast, which will be coming out around August, I think. I don't really know. But it was really fun. And I'll let you know in August or I don't know. It's so, so hot. And I just ate hot soup. I ordered hot soup. Why? Huh? Who does that? On a really hot day. And let's factor in the fact that I do not have an AC. What can I say? Not much going on here. Hi, I have to refilm this because this mic didn't want to save my audio files for some reason. No, no clue why. Let's hope that it saves this one or else I will cry for sure because I'm PMSing, so it'll be even worse. I am opening a Patreon. It'll be open in July. I'm not sure when you'll be seeing this video, but I asked you guys when I was looking to open a shop, I was like, mm, maybe I'll open a shop or a Patreon. Which would you prefer? And nobody wanted the Patreon, but I really wanted to do the Patreon because I don't know. I just, I'm ex it's exciting to me. I feel like it'll be a good place, a good community. I don't know. I have a lot of plans and a lot of ideas for posts and things. Uh, it'll be opening July 1st at 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So whenever you see this video, it'll be probably open and you can join if you would like to. If you don't know, Patreon's kind of like this place where you can support your favorite 
artists and creators uh, and the way that I'll be using it will be offering in return like exclusive content so three different tiers the first tier will be access to the patreon feed and updates and kind of how I'll be using that as like blog posty type posts um, which will be really fun and I'm very excited about. I've got so many things planned but at the same time I want it to be something that you want so it'll be like what do you want and you'll tell me and I'll be like okay here it is. Early access to the shop so if the shop ever closes and reopens and you have early access to that or perhaps early access to new products whatever it may be and then the second tier has all of that but also includes early access to YouTube videos by like a day probably and then also a monthly patreon exclusive video and or live stream with the live stream we'd have to figure that out together because time zones the world yeah basically to make it as available to as many people as possible and then the top tier which i'm very excited about will be a set of three prints four by six in a stamped envelope where that was a convoluted sentence exclusive to patreon only set of three prints so they will only ever be offered on patreon so completely exclusive they will never be on the shop so yeah that's my patreon and i hope that you will enjoy it if you are able to join and i hope that you can join if you can like with everything that i've been venturing into recently i'm very anxious about it but i hope it'll be good i hope please go join my patreon well also forgot to mention that the top tier has a limited amount of spots because i only order so many prints so also there's going to be a new pack in the shop by the time that this video goes up my belize pack the photos that i took in belize not all of them i because i haven't gone through majority of the photos that i took in belize because those i'm saving for my thesis for senior year hopefully the patreon goes well because if it does then i want to open a fourth tier in the future um when i have access to printers again uh i want to print out like f a5 or bigger sized uh prints and those will be like super exclusive so they'll have a limited amount ever created of them so like maybe 10 or 20 ever going to be printed in that specific dimension professional artists write like a little um number in pencil and it's like 30 out of 100 you own one of only 100 that'll ever exist um that's it i hope you all are well uh good news today i just booked rocky's flight back to america so he'll be back june 10th and i'm so excited like i'm so excited just imagine how excited and happy he will be to see me ah! so i'm excited to see rocky and then we move somewhere i don't know i'm not moving out of new york i just needed to move apartments so if anybody has an apartment for me no i'm kidding um unless no that's kind of weird anyways goodbye hopefully this recorded wish me luck <laughs>